Looks cool, right? This is a hand gesture media controller. Using this gesture controller, you can control the media player using simple hand gestures. You can start, play or pause the song, go to next song, play previous song, increase, reduce and mute volume. To make this, all you need is a gesture sensor and an Arduino board that can act as HID or Human Interface Device. In this video, I will explain this sensor, HID using Arduino and the code. Let's get started. PHA7620 Gesture Sensor is a quick and easy way to add gesture control to your Arduino or Raspberry Pi project. This little sensor can recognize various hand gestures such as moving your hands up, down, left, right, forward, backward, clockwise, anti-clockwise and waving. It employs an inbuilt proximity sensor which can sense approaching and departing objects. In the previous video, I explained everything about this gesture sensor, how to connect this sensor to Arduino and read hand gestures. If you are not familiar with that, click the link below and watch that first. I have also uploaded a video on making this gesture control robot using the sensor. If you are interested, take a look, I will leave the link in the description. Some Arduino board can act as HID or Human Interface Device as a keyboard or a mouse and send keystroke through USB like a real keyboard. When you connect the Arduino to the USB port of the computer, it will act as a keyboard and send keystrokes to it. In this project, we will be sending media control keystrokes to the PC using Arduino Maker 1000. For that, we will be using Nikohood library. As I mentioned earlier, this is a simple project. Connections are pretty easy, you won't need more than 1 minute to set this up. You can use any Arduino board that can act as HID like Maker 1000, Promicro, Leonardo, to name a few. I will provide the complete list in the description. Now let us start connecting them together. Guys, before going further, if you find this video useful, consider supporting my channel by giving this video a like and subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button below. I would really appreciate it. Connections are simple. Simply connect V into 5V, ground to ground, SEL to SEL and SDA to SDA. You will find complete details in my blog. You will find the link in the description. Once the connections are completed, you can use double sided tape to fix the Arduino board and the gesture sensor somewhere. I fixed the Arduino board behind the speaker and the gesture sensor on top of it like this. That's it guys, have fun! Now start your media player and try various hand gestures. Move your hand towards the sensor to play or pause. Right to play the next song. Left to play previous song. Clockwise to increase volume. Anti-clockwise to reduce volume. And top to down to mute. That was fun, right? In our channel, you'll find lots of Arduino and Raspberry Pi projects and tutorials using latest boards and sensors. Our main focus is on DIY hobby projects, robotics and home automation using simple and cheap components in a fun and easy way. Make sure you subscribe and click on the bell icon so that you won't miss our fun videos. Thank you guys, see you soon!